na sana kung magre-react dito sa mga ganap sa Miss Universe pagkatapos. Pero nakita ko tong video na to at talaga naman, hindi mo talaga maiwasang mainis dito sa owner ng Miss Universe na si Kun An. She's just, you know, acting so unprofessional. And, alam mo yun, you expect a higher standard sana of engagement or the way to engage with um, pageant fans, especially na this is a global brand. What I can just say is napaka, napaka classy ni Michelle D. And even though it really hurts na nakikita mo yung pain uh, na nararamdaman niya because she really did try her best along with her team and alam naman natin na um, kung walang mga mekos-mekos na mapangyayari she should have been given the chance to talk sa mic but of course now that it's over and um, she wasn't able or she was not even given that chance to hold the mic uh, talagang she's just trying to represent and be out there, ipakita na ang mga Pilipino ay um, marunong tumanggap ng, ng mga pangyayari. And of course, uh, alam din naman natin na si Miss Nicaragua was also a very prayerful woman. She has also good advocacies. Uh, alam mo yon and nakikita rin natin yung joy ng mga taga Nicaragua for being able to experience yung una nilang panalo for about 72 years na halo. So, talaga naman na kahit na nalulungkot tayo uh, na hindi, hindi si Michelle di yung nanalo, uh, na, naunawaan mo rin yung joy din ng ibang country. I just, ang hindi ko lang talaga gusto the way um, Anne cheapens the Miss Universe, the Miss Universe brand. I mean, ang layo talaga nung no mga unang days ng ng Miss Universe and in fairness to the Trump era talaga uh, ang layo ang layo talaga the way uh, this um owner is handling it sana ibenta niya na lang sa iba as we see na when she handled it o nung binili niya mas lalong nagplummet yung stocks and value ng Miss Universe and so sana may bumiling mas credible na tao and um hindi kung ano-ano yung mga nilalagay nila. And, um, I have to say din talaga na, I mean, no offense to the LGBT community or, or the trans community. We, we, uh, I have LGBT friends and, and, and friends na trans and sometimes there are just things that happen in life na hindi natin, um, ma-explain. But, siguro naman, alam ko na hindi lang din ako yung nag na magsasabi na, ang Miss Universe sana should, should remain uh, for women. Women, um, women participants or the way uh, it was started, the way it began before uh, na hindi kung ano-anong additions in an attempt to be um, relevant because it was really perfect the way it was. And it was the standard in the past. So, yun, um, it's an aspiration, actually, um, alam mo yun, it's something that is aspirational for, for, for all women out there, and even the men who are watching, and so, yun, um, basta balik na lang tayo sa, hindi ko masisisi yung mga naiinis din talaga dito kay Anne, because she's just adding salt to the wounds and it was totally unnecessary for her to do this video na move on, move on, yung ganon ganon niya. It's just, alam mo yun, buti na lang si Michelle D is showing that she has a good relationship with Antonia and that they're friends and that, um, alam mo yun, that's why we admire her more. Alam mo kung pwede lang sabihin, Michelle, Michelle D, um, she will have a homecoming on November 25th we are so proud of you and uh, we know that you did your best out there and um the designer of your gowns you mark you did an 
absolute amazing job and um know know that you have cemented uh your your status and credibility here in the Philippines kayo nila pau grabe pareho kayo masakit talaga na alam mo yon syempre ganun yon we, we sort of feel that we are robbed or something but at times when these things happen it is only because para ma-realize din natin as a country what we are worth and um we decide which pageants talaga yung dapat pa nating sinusuportahan sa hindi without of course being bitter about it so that's all